toilet paper that's a cheese grater. No. Metal sheets of cheese grater. What? So you Sorry, know what a cheese the... grater is, right? I know what a fucking cheese grater is! You know what toilet paper is, right? <laughs> no, I don't know what that is! Of course I know, I'm not stupid! Okay, combine the two, there you go. Cheese that grater. doesn't make any sense! The toilet paper, <laughs> that is a cheese grater. <laughs> No! <laughs> yeah. Sony, listen up. I am going to beat Mental Breakdown and give you a Mental Breakdown, okay? Yo! I'm so fucking lost right now. My <laughs> brain really exploded. Have you been out in the sun at all? No. When was the last Wait, time the sun that? touched you? I mean, last time I went like outside was like a month ago or two. Can you Shut please show me up. on this chart where the sun touched you? No, I wanted to make that joke! <laughs> 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 fuck! It's solely. The fuck you won't! You're cool. Oh. Oh. That's nice. Oh. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna cry. I got... Bouncy <laughs> ball. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit, a bomb. The end has been destroyed. Uh, that's that it. Sound ah! <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> I threw it at the wall and it bounced back. <laughs> you idiot. No, Bean. It's Mujige. <laughs> no, that's funny! <laughs> oh no! Hey, Bean, have you ever considered drinking tea? I'm on the floor. <laughs> I'm in a new country right now. I might as well just be in, like, Connecticut. <laughs> what no, if mama. I threw the goat? Uh -oh. Wait one second. <laughs> 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 it's not even goat noise, it just hit the fucking thing! <laughs> I feel the like goat hit the keyboard. <laughs> Wait, I want to throw something too now. I'm gonna throw a glass band. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> <laughs> Why did it shatter? God, it broke. <laughs> I, think, oh, I think we can tell. It's in so much pieces. Oh wow, I'm gonna throw what? another one. <laughs> oh no, my harmonica is landed on the floor. Let's go retrieve it. <laughs> I have a harmonica. She's ever gonna treat it way better, way better. Oh, with that shark. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a hammerhead? That's a hammerhead shark! That's not funny. Anyway, here's a stress ball. <laughs>you said gg too early curb there's a double spike oh uh, i'm i'm very sorry i almost jinxed it oh my god I was i'm was. i guessing very like, nervous when i said gg how long was i playing that for i said like four hours yesterday i got like 30 fails at 79 my fucking god like how did i not fail at 79 this entire session what how <sighs> Uh, I have kind of the same problem right now with the well I'm not gonna mention because everybody's is gonna be like, well, oh my god, you've said that man like uh, that thing every like 37 times. I, I, I'm pretty sure you all know which level I'm talking about. I'm gonna give my review on this. In I also have done. I have died at 454. So that was Chaotic Machine by Geometry Josh and Jekko. 
Overall, the entire level is a pretty pleasant experience, save for the last 30%, which can really impact the enjoyability of the level. So let's go into the gameplay aspect of the level. The first ball is very similar to that of Decode, where the first few taps are a bit tricky, especially on a new attempt, and if you're not really expecting it, but the rest of the ball is somewhat simple, very much like Decode. The first memory section is amazing. It is some of the best memory I have played in this game. And that is from a 1.9 level, and it compares to 2.1 memory levels we've got today. So I absolutely love it. Massively done. So simple, yet so unique. And it never feels unfair. The difficulty is consistent. Great memory section. The duels, the wave, your foe duel can be difficult at the start, but definitely starts to ease out towards the second half of that part of the, uh, of the duel. Then there's the ball cube duel, which apart from the yellow purple orb timings is pretty simple. You only have to tap three times. And then there's the wave ball duel, which it's only really the wave at the bottom. However, there's two points or so where the wave can really impact how you do the ball and whether or not you'll pass it. Then you've got the buffer memory section, which shouldn't be too much of a problem. There's only five fakes in that section. However, because you're going to be thinking about the ship section coming up, you can easily fail there. And if you're starting to fatigue and tire, then you can very easily fail there. Then there's the transition to the last ship. Not the best. And the rest of the ship itself is pretty simple, straightforward. The 79% part of the ship is probably the hardest part, at least in my opinion. Very difficult part to navigate, especially with the blue orb before and the fact you're going at such an angle you have to hold down early but you will probably hit the blue orb at some point. Then there is the 85% transition to the UFO which again depending on how you do it can really impact on how luck based it can feel. Today I started to ignore the purple orb in the mini portal and that really helped to make it feel consistent, got it done pretty quickly, 15 minutes today compared to 4 or so hours yesterday. Then the rest of the UFO gameplay, pretty simple, pretty straightforward, but with the pressure surmounting at the end, it can definitely be something that gets you riled up and if you fail there, it can definitely cause a reaction. Then you've got the final cube, which in the update, which happened to the level, not sure when it was, but you can look on the older videos, there isn't any jump there but in the current version at least as of this recording there is a double spike at the end of the platform which is easiest passed by lining up your icon to the edge of the gg and doing a double jump so overall the entire level is pretty pleasant last ship section can definitely make it less pleasant to play but the first memory is if you're into memory to die for some of the best memory i've played in this game so yeah let me know if you want more of these sort of reviews at the end of a level and yeah i'll see you in the next video